and opportunities for all. Through property tax governance reforms and ring fencing user charges on urban infrastructure, cities will be incentivized to improve their credit worthiness for municipal bonds. Like the RIDF, an urban infrastructure development fund will be established through use of priority sector lending shortfall. This will be managed by the National Housing Bank and will be used by public agencies to create urban infrastructure in Tier 2 and Tier 3 cities. States will be encouraged to leverage resources from the grants of the 15th Finance Commission as well as existing schemes to adopt appropriate use of charges while accessing the UIDF. We expect to make an available to make available 10,000 crore rupees per annum for this purpose. All cities and towns will be enabled for 100% mechanical desludging of septic tanks and sewers to transition from manhole to machine hole mode. Enhanced focus will be provided for scientific management of dry and wet waste. Honorable Speaker, sir, our Prime Minister had said, good governance is the key to a nation's progress. Our government is committed to providing a transparent and accountable administration which works for the betterment and welfare of common citizens. Mission Karma Yogi. Under Mission Karma Yogi, center, states and the union territories are making and implementing capacity building plans for civil servants. The government has also launched an integrated online training platform, I Got Karma Yogi, to provide continuous learning opportunities for lakhs of government employees to upgrade their skills and facilitate people-centric approach. Sir, for enhancing ease of doing business, more than 39,000 compliance more than 39,000 compliances have been reduced and more than 3,400 legal provisions have been decriminalized. For furthering the trust-based governance, we have introduced the Jan Vishwas Bill to amend 42 central acts. This budget proposes a series of measures to unleash the potential of our economy. Centers of Excellence for Artificial Intelligence. For realizing the vision of make AI in India and make AI work for India, three centers of excellence for artificial intelligence will be set up in top educational institutions. Leading industry players will partner in conducting interdisciplinary research, develop cutting-edge applications, and scalable problem solutions in the areas of agriculture, health, and sustainable cities. This will galvanize an effective AI ecosystem and nurture quality human resources in the field. National Data Governance Policy to unleash innovation and research by startups and academia, a national governance, data governance policy will be brought out. This will enable access to anonymized data. The KYC process will be simplified, adopting a risk-based instant, instead of one-size-fits-all approach. The financial sector regulators will also be encouraged to have a KYC system fully amenable to meet the needs of digital India. One-stop solution for identity and address, address updating. 
a one-stop solution for reconciliation and updating of identity, an address of individuals maintained by various government agencies, regulators and regulated entities will be established using DigiLocker, uh, DigiLocker service and Aadhaar 